the Lockerbie bomber was convicted on evidence pieced together from the fragments of Pan Am 103. But 30 years on, the full picture of what happened and who is responsible remains unclear. Abdul Basit al Magrahi, the only man convicted, was given compassionate early release from Scottish prison and returned to Libya to die beside his family. Now speaking for the first time, exclusively to ITV News, his son Ali Megrahi claims his father was told early release would only be considered if he stopped appealing, something the Scottish government has always denied. Ali says he will now return to Scotland in a fresh appeal. My father didn't have the chance to, uh, uh, to go on with his appeal and uh, I'm going to finish uh, this uh, uh, chance for him to clear his name. Helga Mosi was among the 270 killed in Lockerbie. Her parents believe the people responsible have never been convicted. We want to see some transparency and some accountability from the people, the politicians and others that we pay to govern and protect us. We haven't had it. On the 30th anniversary of the bombing, families will return to this town, some still trying to find peace without knowing if all of those responsible will ever face justice. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.